Can't go wrong with a rose smell. It makes you feel like you live in a castle. Hi guys, it's new. Oh my gosh, finally I'm ready to talk about Badger. Badger is such a cool brand. They have so many things. I was first introduced to the brand by trying some of their balms that are good for like joint pain and stuff like that. But earlier this year, I decided to finally try some of their skincare because the packaging was really cute and I really liked all the ingredients. And I gave them a try and I'm just so in love with them. I've been using them every day. So I'm gonna talk to you about the stuff that I use. So my daytime moisturizer has been Badger's Argan Face Oil. This one is for all skin types. Now, these products have a lot of ingredients, so I won't go too long listing all of their benefits because they have overlapping benefits, so I'll just kind of briefly go over them. So the base of this argan face oil is obviously argan oil, but there's also jojoba seed oil, baobab seed oil, and pomegranate seed oil. Those as a base have a lot of good fatty acids, a lot of antioxidants, very, very hydrating and moisturizing. Also anti-inflammatory and speeds up the healing process. I'm gonna read from my notes here because there are a lot of ingredients, but there's orange peel oil, bergamot oil, sandalwood oil, sunflower vitamin E oil, and ylang-ylang oil, which is my favorite essential oil. So these have a lot of the same benefits as the base, you know, anti-inflammatory, lots of good um, nutrients for the skin and vitamins. So the citrus parts of it give it an astringent quality, which is also antibacterial and antiseptic, and it improves circulation and improves the texture of the skin. This blend overall just gives such a youthful glow and it has a really lovely citrus smell which is perfect for in the morning to give you a good mental boost as well. If you want to know more about what some of those um, oils do like smell wise for aromatherapy, I have a video about some blends that I make for myself that also have some of the same oils that are in this. So for nighttime, I've been using their Damascus Rose Face Oil. This one is for dry, delicate skin. Now my skin is more mixed, but I love using rose products because it's just so good and I'll explain why right now. So it has the same base as the Argan Face Oil minus the actual Argan Oil. So there's the Jojoba, Pomegranate, and Baobab. Like I said, very uh, high in fatty acids, antioxidants, anti-inflammatory, very hydrating and moisturizing. The other special ingredients are lavender oil, rosehip fruit extract, sea buckthorn fruit extract, rose oil, chamomile oil, and calendula oil. There's a lot going on with these ingredients. They're very cooling, they're also a little bit astringent, uh, hydrating, antibacterial, antiseptic, balancing, anti-aging, there's vitamin E, C, D, and B carotene, lots of fatty acids, and very healing obviously. Um, also these oils are really good for reducing fine lines and wrinkles. This stuff is just so lovely and I don't know, I, I'm in love <laughs> with these products. I, my skin has been just so elastic and heals so much faster when I have a breakout and I just feel like I'm de-aging a little bit. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Soon I will be a toddler. Okay, so the last product I'm gonna talk about is not an oil, but it's part of the same line. This is their Damascus Rose Beauty Balm. So this is like a wax, kind of like a balm, like that. So the base of this is castor seed oil, olive fruit oil, and beeswax. Again, fatty acids, good for smoothing out fine lines and wrinkles. And then similar to the face oil, this has lavender, rose hip, rose oil, calendula, and chamomile. But this also has sea buckthorn fruit extract as well. Again, same kind of benefits, but because it's in this balm, it's really easy to apply under the eyes, on the lips, any places where you might have patchiness or a wound going on. So if I'm having some psoriasis in my ears, I'll put it there. If I'm having some flaky skin here like I get, I'll put it there. It's just so soothing and lovely. You can even use it on your cuticles if you want to be extra fancy. <laughs> oh yeah, and the smell of the rose ones is obviously very rosy. Can't go wrong with a rose smell. It makes you feel like you live in a castle. They do have a sea buckthorn based face oil. I haven't gotten around to trying it yet. Um, I really like these two, they're really great. But um, yeah, so that's my Badger review recommendations. This stuff is really fantastic. Please give it a try if you get the chance. Um, you can find it at Sprouts and you can also find them online, uh, like on Amazon and stuff I believe too. So just search around and see if you can find it and treat yourself if you can. It's really great. 
<laughs> okay, thank you so much for watching. May the spoons be with you. Bye! But this also has sea buckthorn. That's really hard to say, sea buckthorn. But this also has sea buckthorn fruit. <laughs> but this also has sea buck. <laughs> sea buck. <laughs>